I heard that the storm of arrows raged around King Olaf, and I, the king's younger brother, fought beside him bravely. Now I go creeping from forest to forest with little honor. Who knows what my name may yet become, renowned far and wide in the end. I wiped the blood from my greedy sword when the battle was over. I fed the ravens with corpses, while wolves howled in the mountains. The next year I, king of warriors, went east to the land of the Rus. Nowhere have I ever heard of a greater warrior than myself. Side by side the two leaders fought, shoulder to shoulder. Our men lined up, they drove the Pechenegs into defeat and gave the Poles scant mercy. Bleak showers lashed dark prows, hard along the coastline. Iron shielded vessels flaunted colorful rigging. I saw ahead the copper roofs of Byzantium. My swan-breasted ships swept towards the tall towered city. Bravely I fought, risking my life constantly. I captured 80 cities in the land of the Saracens. Then I, the scourge of the Saracens, waged my grim game of war on the level plains of Sicily. I forced the Mediterranean land to submit to the great Emperor Michael. With courage sharp as a sword's edge, I, the great warrior, triumph over all. I left Greece to conquer Palestine, an easy task for me. With my overwhelming power, the land fell to my army. Unscorched and undisputed, may the Almighty protect me. All men know me by now. I fought 18 savage battles wherever I went. With shrewd and awful warnings, I imposed my justice on both banks of the Jordan and curbed robbers' power. All the people could be certain that swift punishment would follow. Any ill deeds or transgression, may my soul abide by Christ. By one glowing gold, but the Emperor of Byzantium, cruelly mutilated, lost the sight of his eyes. I, who fed the wolves, ripped out both the eyes of the Emperor of Byzantium. Strife was unleashed again. I, the warrior king of Norway, marked my cruel revenge on the brave Emperor of the East. The Greek king had betrayed me. Round Sicily we sailed, our ship with pride in all our hearts, running like a forest stag under a warrior crew. It's not for any land lovers to try that voyage again, yet the golden lady in Russia still spurns my suit. My warlike kingdom was complete, I won the match of my desire. I gained a king's daughter and hoard of gold as well. I launched my vessel laden with cargo of riches, freighted with hard-won honor and gleaming gold from Russia. Through storm and gale, I sailed my plunging vessel, and as the sea spray was thinning, I sighted at last Sweden.